What is P-type extrinsic semiconductor's material? The extrinsic P-type semiconductor is formed when a trivalent impurity is added to a pure semiconductor in a small amount. And as a result, a large number of holes are created in it. A large number of holes are provided in the semiconductor material by the addition of trivalent impurities like gallium and indium. Such type of impurities which produces P-type semiconductor are known as the acceptor impurities because each atom of these create one hole which can accept one electron. A trivalent impurity like gallium having three valence electrons is added to germanium crystal in a small amount. Each atom of the impurity fits in the germanium crystal in such a way that its three valence electrons form covalent bonds with the three surrounding germanium atoms as shown here. In the fourth covalent bonds, only the germanium atom contributes one valence electron, while gallium atoms have no valence bonds. Hence, the fourth covalent bond is incomplete, having one electron short. This missing electron is known as a hole. Thus, each gallium atom provides one hole in the germanium crystal. As an extremely small amount of gallium impurity has a large number of atoms, therefore it provides millions of holes in the semiconductor. Energy Band Diagram of P-Type Semiconductor The energy band diagram of a P-Type Semiconductor is a large number of holes or vacant space in the covalent bond is created in the crystal with the addition of the trivalent impurity. A small or minute quality of free electron is also added in the conduction band. They are produced when thermal energy at room temperature is imparted to the germanium crystal forming electron hole pairs. But the holes are more in number as compared to the electrons in the conduction band. This is because of the predominance of holes over electrons of the material is called as a P-type semiconductor. The word P stands for the positive material. Conduction through P-type semiconductor In a P-type semiconductor, large number of holes are created by the trivalent impurity. When the potential difference is applied across this type of semiconductor as shown. The holes are available in the valence band or directed towards the negative terminal. As the current flow through the crystal is by holes which are carrier of positive charge. Therefore, this type of conductivity is known as positive or p-type conductivity. In a p-type conductivity, the valence electrons move from one covalent to another. The conductivity of n-type semiconductor is nearly double to that of a p-type semiconductor. The electrons available in the conduction band of the n-type semiconductor are much more movable than the holes available in the valence band in a p-type semiconductor. The mobility of holes is poor as they are more bound to the nucleus. Even at the room temperature, the electron holes pairs are available. These free electrons which are available in minute quality also carry a little amount of current in the p-type semiconductors.